Hi, this is Mark Cunaberti, financial columns for the Union and host of Money Matters on KVMR FM. Welcome to another edition of Investing in Community, where we bring the amazing organizations, businesses, nonprofits, and today, another eatery to you through social media. And I'm with the founder, once again, of Nevada County Restaurant Reviews, Ms. Tichelle Teach. Hi, guys. Today, we are at the Dog House, located on 174. We are at 745 Highway 174, and today we are going to be talking to the owner, Linda, about her business, and we are so excited to eat some hot dogs and share her menu with you. Ready to eat some hot dogs? I'm ready. I'm starving. I ain't eaten all day of you. No, I'm absolutely starving. Place to go. Let's Here go. we go. Hi, everybody. We're here at the Dog House with the owner, Linda Capaldo, and it's located off of Highway 174. Linda, tell us a little bit about how your business got started. Well, we actually started the business about seven years ago. Uh, we started uh, catering for a lot of the uh, intercom um, bands and stuff like that. We've catered for uh, Kennecke, the Disco, Ball Out Boy, um, all the American authors, all of them. Um, and from there, I just loved the response of feeding people and decided that I wanted to continue to do that. Linda, everything smells delicious coming out of the kitchen. Can you tell us a little bit about your doghouse menu? Actually, I can. Um, at the Dog House, uh, our motto is love what you eat. I am the owner and the chef, and it is very important to me to put out quality food. I do not want people to eat something that I would not personally eat myself. I cook from scratch, I cook with love, and you can taste it in everything that comes out of my kitchen. What are some of the favorite items here? Ooh, well, some of the favorite items for us, the Chicago Dog is very popular. Um, the Western Dog is popular as well. That's Jack Daniels pulled pork that I, I actually uh, cook for uh, 18 hours. I slow wow. roast for 18 hours and you can actually taste it. Everything is my habaneros made from scratch, my crumbs made from scratch, everything's from scratch. So that is making me hungry. Well, Linda, I noticed you have an outdoor venue and it's absolutely beautiful here on the patio and all the fans are blowing and it feels great. What are your plans coming up for the winter and the cold season? I actually intend to stay open year round. Um, as we shift into the cooler weather and football, there will be heaters on the patio. Uh, football screens, uh, lots of uh, happy hour hors d'oeuvres, you know, kind of snacks and stuff like that to kind of cater to the football season, as well as a lot of comfort food like homemade soups and uh, bread, you know, served in bread bowls. Uh, just lovely, a grown up mac and cheese, which is awesome. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so just uh, stuff like that, just to keep it open. And I want everybody to know that they still have somewhere to come, even though it's not, you know, summer. Nice. I think I might be ready to eat. What can I make for you? I think we should order some dogs. What are you thinking, Mark? Yes. Let's go. Okay. Okay. So, dish number one, huh? Dish number one. All right. What do we have? We have the fat boy hot dog. All right. Oh, there my we go. gosh. There you it go. It looks like a fat boy. That's gorgeous. All right. Are you ready for this? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. Cut it up. You can no. cut on your side. I can. There's bacon side. on this fat boy. Do we have, uh, we're going to put it on the napkin. I'm going to get my fingers on the right Yeah, 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 yeah. So, guys, oh, there's pulled pork what it looks like, it. right? All right. That is an all-beef hot dog with pulled pork and tater tots and barbecue sauce and bacon and cheese. Okay. Ready to go. Cheers. That wow. is really, really good. I've never had pulled pork on a hot dog before. No, I have never either. Really that pulled pork is delicious. This is the one she cooks for 18 hours in Jack Daniels. Mm -hmm. Don't hate that. So there's tater tots in here. Mm -hmm. On top. Yeah. Pulled pork. My marinated in Jack Daniels, right? 18, slow roasted for 18 hours. That is slow so roast for that good. is really, really good. Robin, what do we have? This is the 57 Chef Dog. 57, 57 Chef Dog. It's like a BLT on a hot dog. Wow, it's got right. avocado and ranch and fresh tomato and bacon. That looks good. Yeah. Good. All right. Yeah. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. Mm. Wow. Mm-hmm. I can't wait to tell my mom about this place. Okay. So, Linda, what did you bring us here? So now we have uh, my chili, which is a homemade chili with uh, Kobe Wagyu beef, cranberry beans that I get from Chico, mm -hmm. my own special recipe. And what this is, is that? some homemade habanero crema if you need a little Ooh, kick. Ooh, I want a little kick. Kobe and, beef, huh? Wow. Uh, and this is all made from scratch. Is this what you use on the dogs as well? Yeah. All right. 
And this is the habanero green. You know, it's not the death habanero sauce. It's actually very, Kinda very, sweet. yeah, it's delicious. Really good. It's chill. Wow. This stuff rocks. Mm -hmm. Really good. I'm starting to get it. Mm -hmm. I get it. Mm -hmm. What do you got for us? Chicago dog. Chicago, Chicago dog. Okay. Dog. There we go. Holy moly. Show it to the camera. This is a traditional Chicago dog. There with you go. Pickle and mustard and onion and tomatoes. A little bit of green onion. Chicago dog? Chicago dog is fantastic. Looks like it's got a pickle relish and some mustard. The fresh tomatoes are amazing. They've got like the different colored tomatoes. The onions are perfect. The pickle is nice and thin. Whole different type of dogs here. Wow. What Venus. is next? What is next, next is a Philly cheesecake steak. Okay. Wow. Let's do it. Ballpark style. And this is free range beef from Napa. There you go. Free range All right. beef from Napa. It is hot. Wow. Cheers. Are we filming? We are. Cheers. Oh, man. The bread is incredible. Mm hmm. World shipper perfection, but very soft. Really good. Very soft. Mm -hmm. yes. Very tender meat. Look at that. I finally you. get it. Okay, I finally awesome. get it. So awesome. great job. Yeah, thank great you. job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. It was so yummy. All right, that does it for another edition of Investing in Community, where we bring the amazing organizations, events, nonprofits, and great eateries to you through social media. I'm the financial columnist for the union and host of Money Matters on KVMR FM. If you'd like to send us an email, you can do so at news at moneymanagementradio.com. My name's Mark Cunaberti. And I'm Tichelle Tijan. Thank and you for tuning in. I'm Scott. All right. All right we'll Good you. job. Thank Come you and see you later.